Hello, my name is Pranav Ganoud and I'm from Class 10C of AIS School of Ruways. And today I have built an offshore oil rig for Adnox Challenge for building a digital oil rig. And now, as you can see, this is my offshore oil rig and we're approaching its dock. We know that offshore oil rigs are built on water. And so as they're built on water, we will need anchors. Anchors are the main supports that keep it to the ground. And also the main one more component is that there are drill pipes. Drill pipes will go beyond the seabed to extract oil from its source for further refining. And as we have reached the docking area, and there's the drill which goes down to the uh, seabed and beyond. And now we'll be going up to the first floor. And as we come up here, we see the mess. This is, uh, the mess is the main place where all the employees have their food. And now, after the mess, now we are going to the next floor. The next floor has mainly a generator, a cat generator. And this generator powers the full oil rig and also all the control rooms and all. This is the third floor. Now here we have the main location where all the employees relax. This is a relaxing lounge and this is for entertainment purposes. And here they can get rid of the stress and by listening to music and also watching TV. And there are a lot of other paintings. Now we are going higher on the floor. And now we arrive on the next floor. This floor contains a lot of cranes and cranes are for mainly moving heavy stuff and all uh, different crates and even uh, supply uh, crates and containers from the ships onto the oil rig. And we have three cranes over here, one, two and three. And here also there are washrooms. And there's also a laundry facility room. Now, on an oil rig, especially an offshore oil rig, we are going to be uh, needing living quarters as this will be way far away from uh, mainland. And so here we are in the living quarters. And as there are a lot of employees, we will not, we'll be requiring more than one. So here's the next part. And now as we go up, now we can see the main place. This is the main oil drill. And this is one uh, really important for oil uh, employees working in the oil drill to follow Adnox life saving rules strictly. And this is mainly the maintenance ladder that goes up to the derrick. And as you can see, this is the derrick and we are on the catwalk right now. And catwalk is mainly the place where uh, the employees will get their work done. And now we are leaving the living quarters. And as we come out, we can see the helipad. And on the heli uh, helipad sits a helicopter. And helicopters are very important for uh, oil rigs, especially uh, offshore oil rigs, as they are one of the only means of transport for uh, supply containers and mainly for employees and also for medical emergencies, as the mainland is quite far away. And here we see more supply containers. And now we are going towards the control room. So as we enter the control room, we mainly see offices. These are the offices for getting the paperwork done. And here we see the main control room. 
this is the main control panel with uh, many seats for the workers and mainly the technicians to uh, operate the oil rig and all other technical facilities and now we are going up to the conference room and this is the conference room here uh, the main employees can uh, meet and uh, take decisions and as we can see there's uh, there are more cranes and here we come to see an oil container and this is a huge oil container and this mainly contains the refined oil and uh, here are the oil barrels and here we see another uh, huge crane I would like to thank Adnock for this amazing opportunity to build an oil rig and this was a very fun uh, project and also it allowed me to learn a lot about the offshore and onshore oil rigs and so this was a, re a really good opportunity and it allowed me to learn and have fun. Thank you.